I would think that maybe I would imagine he's aware of it, but I would imagine that, you know, he's probably heard the same anecdotes that I'm diving into now of, you know, times that Tony Verlusa has had great relationships with uh, black players or Tony Verlusa has, you know, on certain anecdotes gone, um, you know, and, and put himself on the line to try to uh, advocate for players who are facing, you know, racial, you know, being blackballed like Bruce Maxwell. I'm, I'm sure there's a lot of these standalone, uh, you know, anecdotes of him, you know, acting equitably that he would say like, well, this guy, um, you know, he probably put it maybe the way that Tony put it was like, he doesn't have a racist bone in his body, which, you know, sure, great. But I always feel like a lot, you know, misses the point a little bit. It's not about whether or not you are an active, avowed, intentional racist. It's about whether or not you have blind spots or you have, you know, not complete uh, cultural seven sensitivity or awareness where you're not you're missing things or you're making people feel like they can't air things. You know, there's, there's, there's a whole level of uh, gaps in management and also just interacting and understanding and showing empathy to people that uh, exist between being yes, a racist and not a racist that there's, there's still a, uh, you know, the count for. So I, I'm glad he's not a, you know, avowed racist, like that's great, but the standards, <laughs> The standards are always going to be a little bit, uh, you know, yeah, deservedly yeah. higher. It, yeah. You know, it's, it's not 1960 anymore. We can't, we're not just, we're looking, we're calling for more for, for allies at that point. And I think he's aware of that, but also I, I, I would say the, the judgment is that he's getting there, not that he's someone who I don't think he has immediately on day one the level of cultural awareness that Rick Renneria had, uh, you know, on his last day uh, in this job. So I, I think that's a, a gap they'll be filling over time. And, you know, that that's something to work through over the course of a season where you're expecting big things. 